Hello all, in this video we are going to see the rest of three other modes of operation. Counter mode, Galio's counter mode, counter with cipher block chaining message authentication code mode. Let's see one by one. What is counter mode? This mode uses a stream cipher similar to CFB and OFB modes. However, instead of creating the seed value for each encryption or decryption operation from the result of the previous seed value, it uses simple counter that increments for each operation. As with OFB mode, errors do not propagate in CTR mode. Also, it, this mode allows you to break an encryption and decryption process into multiple independent steps. This makes CTR mode well suited for use in parallel computing. The next one is Galva counter mode. This takes the standard CTR mode of encryption and adds data authenticity control to the mix, providing the recipient assurance of the integrity of the data received. This is done by adding authentication tag to the encryption process. This is the final mode, CTR with CBC, MAC mode, CTR, counter with cyber block chaining mode, with message authentication code. Similar to D GCM, the counter with cipher block chaining message authentication code combines a confidentiality mode with a data authenticity process. In this case, CCM cipher combined the counter mode for confidentiality with the cyber block chaining message authentication code algorithm for data authenticity. CCM is used only with block cipher that have 128 bit block length and requires that use of a nonce that must be changed for each transmission. GCM and CCM modes both include data authenticity in addition to confidentiality. They are therefore known as authenticated mode of encryption ECB, CBC, CFB, OFB and CTR mode only provide confidentiality and therefore they are known as unauthenticated modes. Thank you for watching my video. Make sure to subscribe, like and don't forget to hit the notification bell. Bye.